okay, there's a lot happening. A lot to unpack. And a lot to say. Welcome back to the vlog. We are en route for a road trip. We are going to Deco Lake. We stay, or we're staying at a lake house that we went to two years ago. We have a bunch of friends meeting us up there. Um, so this is our like third annual lake trip, right? Yeah, it is. So there's eight of us. Last year we couldn't get this cabin, so we went to one in Penticton, which we vlogged. But we are on our way. It's 9.15. We are barely left the house, but we left the house an hour ago. Well, to start, I bought a truck. We're in it right now. I got it yesterday, actually. And we're leaving. We, we leave today. Trayden's crazy. Our, obviously, we have our jet ski back there. But we were going to borrow someone's truck. We had it all organized. But Trayden's like, oh, I just really want to buy a truck. I want my own truck. He's wanted his own truck ever since he got rid of his oh. other truck. And we, he went and saw a truck two days ago and he was ready to buy it and the guy just wouldn't come to a price that they would agree on so then he went and saw this truck yesterday and like bought it on the spot yep traded my car in so new truck it kind of has a smell to it so i have like air fresheners all over but yesterday i had to teach so Trayden had all of these chores and packing things that we needed him to do. I still did them. But he ended up buying a truck, which took us till like 10 o'clock at night. And then we had to do everything, like pack all the food, pack our clothes, and just like organize the truck and everything. And then this morning we got up, got everything ready, and realized that our jet ski trailer was not insured. <laughs> So we had to wait till the insurance place opened, which online it said 8.30. So we got there at 8.30, which is in the same complex as Starbucks. Got some Starbucks and turns out they didn't open till nine. So we just waited, got the insurance and now we're en route. We have to stop at Costco to get gas for the jet ski and fill up a jerry can for the jet ski. And then we'll be officially on our way. That's a lot. That just happened in 24 hours. That's, yeah. But he's so happy. I am very happy. To have his truck. This is my spot for me to put my feet up. The gear shifter. Middle section. I really like that this isn't a seat. It's just the middle thing. I don't really like the three seats in the front. Trayden's spot. And then we're loaded up back here but it's very spacious we had a slight issue with the new truck because it started to rain and we quickly learned that the windshield wipers do not work so we pulled over to check the fuse box and there was no fuse in the spot for the wipers, right? Right. So then we went and bought a fuse for it, which wasn't the right fuse. So we ended up just like switching one of the fuses out and the wipers worked. And then we learned very quickly that they would not turn off. And obviously the reason why there was no fuse in the spot was because the person before knew that they wouldn't turn off. So we need to figure out that. So we just took the fuse out again. So we have no windshield wipers, but luckily it has not rained again. Yeah, it doesn't It doesn't go like back and forth, back and forth. It's like once every like 15 seconds, but it's just super annoying because it's super dry, it's sunny out. It's just like wiping the dry window and it's really loud. So we just took the fuse out and yeah, that's the first truck problem I guess yeah I got a warranty so we good yeah we can still drive it so that's not a problem we're about less than two hours away now an hour and a half okay next adventure 
of this road trip. Don't mind the blinking, that's our hazards because our cooler lid keeps opening and I went and closed it, but it keeps flying open. So Trayden's strapping it down and we are 45 minutes away. We'll make it, we'll make it. Just running into some issues. Got you it? got no issues? No issues. You got it? Yeah, the cooler lid just kept on opening. But you fixed it? Problem solved. Good to go, back on route. We made it, we are here at the cabin. Um, we've unloaded all the groceries and stuff. Also then we're right on the water, so this dock on the left is like a private dock for this house. So we get that, we have the fire pit there. Yeah, it's a little bit gloomy and a bit colder today, but it's supposed to get warm tomorrow. <laughs> Cabin. It's like day two. Did not vlog at all yesterday. Yesterday was like kind of like a chill day. It the was... weather was not great, so we stayed pretty much inside all day. But today, sunny, skies are blue. Mm. Tage is making us breakfast this but he's morning. He's actually not making breakfast. He's kind of just, just been standing around. He's like, how many eggs do I make? Because Let's like, see. You like this, you like this, doing nothing. It's good lighting. We got up and put the jet ski in the water, and now a few more people are up. We're gonna have breakfast and then we're at the lake all day today. Oh yeah. Okay. Good morning, it is our last day here. Everyone else has already gone home. It's probably like 11.30 right now and we just put the jet ski in the water. We are like the only ones on the lake. Well, it's just me right now. Um, Trayden's gonna come down and we're gonna dock it and then just spend the day on the lake. It is so sunny, so warm today. When we woke up, it was already 29 degrees, so cannot complain. We just played some Yahtzee down on the dock. I, lost twice. I beat Trayden twice and I didn't know how to play this game. So maybe it was beginner's, beginner's luck. luck, yeah, but I did. I beat her in chess though. Checkers. Same thing. Yeah, so we're gonna go back up to the house now and um, make a pizza. And then we'll probably come back down for like another hour or so. Since everyone else left today, we are trying to get like all of the laundry done from like their towels and bedding and stuff so that there's less to do tomorrow. So we've been going back and forth doing laundry all day. So we'll go in, make our pizza and switch over the laundry because there's three beds that need to be done and like a bunch of towels and blankets that we use at the fire. So we've just been doing laundry all day long. Okay, pizza is in the oven we did some laundry and made the beds downstairs Trayden is seasoning holy these are massive our steaks for dinner tonight gonna barbecue them those are literally huge <laughs> once we have some lunch i think we'll go back to the lake for like another hour or two and then come make dinner and get everything organized
to get some food and something to drink. I think I'm gonna get like a banana bread or something. Because we already had breakfast. It's like 10.30 right now, but we don't, we have some snacks. We don't really have like a lunch thing. So we'll get something, but yeah, such a fun trip. It was. Fun late nights and then like long days in the sun too, so that always makes you tired, but. Yeah, the weather is not gonna be as nice anymore. Yeah, the last good day was yesterday. Got the goods. Yeah. And we're off. I went pee, got some coffee, ready to go. We are home now. I'm just unloading all of our leftover groceries and things. Trayden is cleaning his truck with my mom. We're done washing Trayden's truck. It's all cleaned up, everything's put away. We are just driving back home home that's gonna be the end of our lake trip vlog thank you guys for coming along hope you enjoyed this video yeah we'll see you in the next video bye guys bye